So there's Jupiter. I'm gonna do another update on her. Because let's be honest, she's an Eldabra giant tortoise. And she's what people come to see. And she's what I would come to see. And I don't have her on the page um, anywhere near enough. So I'm gonna start updating uh, the page with her a lot more often. And she's getting really big. I mean, she's not a big tortoise, don't get me wrong. But she's putting on a ton of size. So I'm gonna grab her, I'm gonna get a weight on her. So just so you can see how big she's gotten, she really has put some size on. And we're gonna get her right up here on the uh, scale. And we're at 495 grams. That is about quadruple what I got her as. And let's see what her resting temperature is here. She's at 84 degrees, 83 degrees, I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. 83 to 85, that ballpark. So, a nice, warm, wet house for her. This is her indoor house. This is where she lives. Uh, in the colder months, I'm hoping in about a month that she'll spend almost all of her days outdoors and then just come and sleep in this uh, enclosure. Because, you know, that's where the tortoises um, belong. And we've come uh, quite a ways with uh, little Jupiter here. Um, she's still not super um, comfortable, but she's much better. And I'm not pushing anything. I'm just taking my time with her. And she's, uh, she's starting to be a little more receptive. She's definitely less afraid. Um, like her head isn't going in anymore. She used to just shoot her head back in anytime I touched her. Um, or run, but now she's kind of just chilling out, which is great. I can go in there and I can pet her on the shell. Um, sometimes I can get her on the head, and she just chills. But right now, because uh, I'm holding a phone, and I'm doing this with one hand, I don't really want to start poking her in the head. But she's, um, she's really amazing. Um, she's a joy to have. I adore this tortoise. I cannot wait till she's a giant. And at the growth rate she's going at, I think I'm going to have to build her a building a lot sooner than I was expecting. I was expecting to have at least two or three years. I'm thinking I have one more year before I have to build her something. Because she's almost quadrupled her size since I got her eight months ago. And then I'm sure she's going to slow down her growth rate as she gets larger. But let's say she doubles her growth rate in the next year. That'll put her at almost three pounds and a very large um, tortoise to be indoors and I, I think if I wait much longer than that I'm gonna have some difficulties so I'm gonna start planning for and getting the uh, outdoor building set up for her and uh, you know times will be good uh, everything else in the room is really good I'm gonna do an update on the uh, four stands and the alligator snapper and uh, the Red Foots will be going outside in a week or two, so there'll be an update on that. So there'll be lots of stuff on this channel for uh, whomever wants to see it. Really for me to just go back and monitor growth and um, all that fun stuff. And uh, that's about it. But yeah, we're going to do a lot more updates on this uh, beautiful little guy or girl. Tortoise. This beautiful little tortoise. And that's it.